Well, hello everybody. This is actually take two for this video. First one didn't come out right. I got a bit had uh, no audio. No audio. I mean, what was this? Uh, well, I have to explain to you what's going on. What I was doing. Uh, I got this. I've always have worked with the uh, for the last I don't know how long. I've worked with the. My micro a mono microphone, and I'm, I've ordered a piece, an adapter, so it takes it'll go from mono to both channels, left and right. And whenever I got it, I tried that; it worked good. I made the hole a little bit larger to fit it, and it worked good. But I noticed the tape would could move the the plug around a little bit, so I taped it to keep it. You know, I mean, it was pushed in to the socket. Well, here it pushed the sock, it pushed into the socket a little bit too far past the uh, the connections, so it, it gave me nothing. Gave me nothing. I don't trust people. So what I ended up doing is I freaking cycled through stuff, trying to figure out what was going on, and just discovered it was just being pushed in a little too far. So I went ahead and cut the tape. That was pushing it in and just wrapped it so it would, couldn't move. And it's also sealed from water a little bit, you know. But it worked good whenever I was in the house. And another thing, I came up with a freaking my room was wasabi batteries. Finally, are going for the ghost. I, uh, oh, I've had them for what, a little over two years, maybe? Give or take a little, maybe. About two years, and they're finally going for the ghost. My well, wasabi batteries for the GoPro Hero 2, which is not a big deal. I mean, I, I didn't, I, I paid less than 20 bucks for them, I believe. Got two of them in the charger, and I found another deal on Amazon where I could get the same batteries well, close to the same batteries actually, they're a little bit longer life, supposedly. And I can use the charger that I still have, it still, still works good. I'm only paying like 11 bucks. So we'll go ahead and scream for that next month. Scream for that next month and uh, we'll, we'll be rocking and rolling, you know? But luckily I have my spare battery. Well, I have my backup. I, I had what, what, two original GoPro batteries. One went bad on me, actually swelled up and went bad. The other one I just put back and I just used it on my trips. Well, we uh, I pulled that out to make sure it was all charged up and all good and everything, and I'm using that along with my wasabis. My wasabis will charge for, will actually run for, oh, maybe 10, 15 minutes. <laughs> so whenever I go on a trip, if I go on a trip before I get them in, my replacements in, I'll just go ahead and carry my charger and carry the three batteries. Because, I mean, I know this battery here, It'll last me a while. It'll last me maybe half hour, 45 minutes. Who knows? Kalu, kalu. Sell them UX. Excuse me. What are we doing right now? Well, we are going to get Muslim Mike a new set of eyes. Yeah, I ordered them a few weeks ago. Went in and had the doctor check my eyes out a few, about a week ago. And they're, they're in. I got a phone call saying they're in. And I'm like, great, I'm working with freaking audio, I mean, video. Video editing, I'd like to have good eyes. Not the blurry ones like I have. Uh, oh, I did see an orthopedic doctor just about uh, last Wednesday. You know, I'll have to explain to you what happened there. Come on. Well, let's go to the orthopedic doctor. Last Wednesday, he gave me a boatload of information that I didn't have. Ortho, my left hip, total hip replacement, which consists of the stem that goes into the leg, 
the, fe the, the femur head and the uh, the porcelain. Actually, it's a, it's a porcelain liner inside of a cup. It's in the, actually in the pelvis. Okay, now you got the hint. Of, you get you get the idea what my hip consists of. Well, what the, I was afraid of going out because I was told back when I got it, first got it in, you only can have two, and then they can't really do much with it when it goes out. Now this, this doctor said, no, 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 no. That was the old way of doing it. So we could actually change the ball out and change the liner out for you. It might be a lot less of a surgery and uh, less healing time. So I'm going to go ahead and and he looked at it and said, you know what? Look at the x-rays. said that's actually a glass head ball, which is very old and they do wear out. In fact, they fracture. You have a porcelain uh, liner inside the, ca the cup. He said, uh, let's make sure you don't have any sh shards inside you causing you problems. Um, so I'm going to go through a bunch of tests with that, for that. And he said, but he does want to change the head out along with the liner. Which is cool with me. I mean, this hip, I was told originally was 15 years lifespan. I got it, I mean, that was 93. Do the math, it's 20 something years old. 23? Yeah. So it's time to go ahead and uh, be 23 at the beginning of August. Um, it's, it's time. It's time to go ahead and get a new, get new parts put in me and I can, go, I can go on with my life after a short healing process. Now, he said this is not a must for, unless he finds something drastic wrong. It doesn't have to be done right now. So what we can do is uh, just schedule it and uh, work at a leisure, which is great. I will be able to uh, maybe do that at the end of winter time, into springtime. That way I'm not missing much of my riding season. And I'm just pretty much out of the ice season. That way I don't have to worry about when I'm healing, falling down, and injuring myself. Well, I'm at the optical, that's Sharon Optical Center, and uh, I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys all have a great day. This was Mike. Signing out, guys.